is not just about safety. It's also about perceived safety. I was in a driverless car at the time. It had a, a safety driver at the wheel. So I got in. First of all, it was like, oh, this is very new. This is interesting. But I knew there was a safety driver there. Now there's no safety driver. So I don't know how I'd react when I, when I next get into my, my driverless car. But what is consumer acceptance like? How are people reacting? One of the key design principles of our autonomous driving vehicles is not just about safety. It's also about perceived safety because we use all the uh, human-like driving uh, uh, comfortness and also use the HMI. So it's basically the, the human interface within the vehicle to give the riders, give the passengers a sense of safety. So, so our experience has been the, the riders typically after three, four minutes, they, they took the vehicle just as a typical human driving taxi, right? They start put, taking out the phones, looking at their phone or, or take a nap. So, so I think it's very easy for the riders to get used to it.